everybody. Somebody's not happy. While waiting for my uh, lava lizard to hatch, I decided I'm going to build a uh, scanner room down here. And I realized I never really explored the um, abilities of the scanner room. I just made it and left, so... Four titanium ingots, four lubricant, advanced wiring kit. Luckily, I have all that. I said, I think he patrols the inactive lava zone, and he, uh, when he's in my area, he's just drawn to my base. So, oh, I hate to put a battery in this thing anyway. Oh, there he is, right there. I don't know why my game seems darker. Get out there and start building my uh, scanner room after I put a battery in my builder. So, see you guys in a bit. Yeah, I was uh, building that to put my scanner room at the end of, which I actually will do. do that. Uh, let's see, what do I need? Uh, da, 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 there it is. Fiber mesh, computer chip, and titanium five. Wow, that's a lot. Okay. Well, I think I still have one computer chip left. Yep. Fiber mesh and ten titanium. Five titanium, I think it said. Wiring kit. Wiring kit. Oh no, that's the wrong thing. There we go. I think I have some more, but they're on my. They'd be on my cyclops. So actually, I think I'll pop over there and grab them. Be right back. Okay, that's done. I got plenty of med kits now, so time to build my scanner room. Oh, shoot, enamel glass. Did I grab the wrong one? No, that's right. Enamel glass, computer chip. Oh, what did I grab for? Oh, I grabbed for a minute. <laughs> I gotta grab the stuff for a scanner room. I grabbed the wrong things. I'm probably gonna have to make some of it too. Okay, so actually let me put the stuff back that I took. Don't need that. Don't need that. And I don't need that. But I can build another moon pool if I want. Okay, so what do I need for the scanner room?
enamel glass, computer chip, and two computer chips and three titanium. Okay, so I don't think I have two computer chips anymore. Oh, I gotta grab the stuff that's not powered. Okay. I'm putting the non-powered stuff over in a different locker so I can keep then I can power my battery. Okay, so let me gather that stuff up. Oh, actually I have the enamel glass right there. Ta-da! I just gotta make the rest, so I'll gather the ingredients and make those in a sec. So see you guys then. Okay, so I have the enameled glass. Now I just need to make computer chips, but I need the new computer chips with gold and copper wire. So one, two. There. Now I should have what I need. Yes, perfect. Okay. So I'm gonna go out and build that scan room. Hopefully that warper will leave me alone. Oh wait, I need to get myself. There we go. I don't see him anywhere. Okay, so let's build my scanner room. Why won't you go? Okay, maybe I can't do it at the end of the glass compartment. So let me just deconstruct that. And build my scanner room. Oh, goodness, it's the Reaper area all over again. Okay, so he wants to build it there. No, no, actually, she. I see what the problem is. It's not uh, pointing towards my base. Okay, so I got my scanner room. Let's go check this out. Because, like I said, I never really looked at what it can do. I made sure to reinforce my base extra, too, so. Uh, just a tip. You can build lockers on a reinforced wall, but you cannot build a reinforced wall behind lockers. So, make sure you reinforce your base first. Okay, so. Now I can build some stuff here, so let me see what I need for that. Come on. Okay. Streams data from the scanner room to the HUD. Camera, I can build an extra camera drum, I don't care about that. Quartz and a computer chip. Range update and speed upgrade. Okay, so I need quartz and computer chips to do that. And gold and computer, so I need three computer chips, one gold and two quartz. So I'll go get that, and I'll be with you guys back in a sec. Okay, so I got the ingredients that I need. Now let's see. I'll build the scanner room HUD chip, whatever that is. I'm sure I'll figure it out. Range upgrade. And speed upgrade. Okay. So let's go put those in. So I got the range update. Huh. Okay, that for some reason doesn't go into the scanner room. Oh well. That's fine. I've got the speed and the range, so. Wow, that's a. Oh, that is so cool! So that's me. Oh, there's the two cameras. There's the lava castle. That's so cool, and you can actually see the uh, walls of the inactive lava zone and the tunnel behind me, which I checked out and doesn't really seem to go anywhere. Wow, that's cool. Okay, so let's. Uh... Oh, cool! And it even tells me what's nearby. So let's go check out the camera, shall we? 
Okay, so there's a warper. Let's go down this hole and see what there is. So my range now should be really uh, far. Oh yeah, look at the bottom bottom left corner. There's distance or depth and distance. It doesn't really say if I'm reaching my depth or my distance. So down here, I believe, is the primary containment unit. And I can hear a lot. Uh, Sea Dragon Leviathan. So I haven't seen it since the. Uh, uh, there's a Sea Dragon there. I haven't been down here since I started my new game. Oh, yeah. Okay, you can kind of see. Oh, see, it's getting fuzzy. So I reached the max of my range. But there's the prison, and there's the entrance to the prison. I wonder if I can go there yet. But the sea, uh, this sea Emperor has not been implemented in game yet. So that when, and just to let you know, when it gets fuzzy, that's their way of saying you're going beyond range. So I wonder if I could increase my range with another upgrade. Like, do the are they stackable? It seems to go pretty fast, but my range is not uh, what I'd like it to be. So let me see if I can. Uh, Make it go a little further. Oh, I was gonna say, was that lava lizard attacking my camera? No, I guess not. Health is still fine. A lot of lava larvae. Yeah, that's down here. Oh, okay, just a little tunnel. This is fun, though. It's like exploring in complete safety. So that must be the obsidian chunks. I guess they didn't. They haven't developed a new um, skin for those yet, because those are what the original nodes looked like. Okay. So the primary containment unit is exactly below the thermal plant. Well, that's cool. But it's being guarded by a sea dragon, which is not cool. It's going to be a lot harder to get in there and uh, check it out. Oh, look at all the re all the warpers too. Wow, this is really neat. But the distance is not what I would hope it would be. Can I go to the uh, thermal plant? At least the camera drones don't attack, attract attention. I think the only thing that pays attention to them are the stalkers. Where was the entrance? I found it right away last time. Are you attacking my base? between me and the thermal plant. But like I said, he, so the camera drones don't seem to attract any attention. Wow, the animation on that thing is so cool. But I remember the first time I came down here, there was like three of these guys up here. But now I think there's only the one. Anywho, I was looking for the entrance. I wonder if the Warper and the Sea Dragon ever fight. That'd be cool. Where are you? I wonder what that weird sparkly stuff is. Anyway, okay, so I got a fair bit of range. Let me see. Because it started getting grainy right below. 
let me see if I'm correct in assuming that the uh, primary containment unit's right underneath this thing. Oh! Lava lizard egg discovered! Yay! Okay, well, uh, that that's a uh, blessed event has happened. Let's go check it out. Mm. It's got a fair bit of speed on this. So that's kind of cool. Again, I do find it interesting that pretty much everything ignores the camera except the stalkers, and the stalkers just uh, think of it as some kind of toy. I didn't realize there was a space here. I could actually probably build a whole, a whole other room there. Hmm. Have to keep that in mind. Uh, which camera was this? Camera's there, so it must have been there. Ow, shoot. Uh. Ow. That was dumb of me. Oh well. Why can't I dock? I mean, this is the spot, right? Okay, that was the camera drone. Okay, so uh, it was the other side. The reason I hit it is because the camera drone was there. It just looks like there's a camera drone already in there, that's all. See, like, doesn't that look like a camera drone is in there? Right, here, let's uh, dock. There we go. Hit escape. Yep, perfect. So doesn't show any life forms, but still, that's kind of cool. Does it actually, do you see underneath? I think it does scan underneath a bit. I think I can see the, yeah, I think I can see the cave of the primary containment unit. Now, I saw a door in the primary containment unit, so I wonder if I can go in there and check it out. But the sea dragon will rip my prawn suit apart in a heartbeat. But I am double reinforced, so... Uh, you know what? I might do that in my next video. Meanwhile, let's check out the new addition to my family. Oh, he's actually pretty cute. Less adorable. You're, you, you're still terrifyingly adorable. But he's... he's kind of cute. Actually, I don't know if it's a he, because I think they said that all the... Uh, beings on this planet are one gender. Aww. Okay, so once again, guys, uh, if you, uh, if you want to suggest some names for these guys, I'd appreciate it. Just leave it in the comments. I think that's pretty much all I'm going to do today. Uh, like I said, I was just waiting for that little guy to to uh, hatch, and he has. And you guys can see just how cute he is. And uh, I'll see you guys in my next video where I think I will probably go down with my prawn suit and check out the primary containment unit. So keep an eye out for that, guys. These are all my power cells from the uh, cyclops that were drained by the lava larvae. I'm just going through and filling all those up. Okay, so uh, I guess I'll see you guys in my next video end it by going uh, into my observation thing and checking out if the sea dragon's there, which he probably is. And I'm hungry, so I'll have to eat too. Okay, there he is. Bye. <laughs> okay, guys. See you next time. Bye.